Hey there. So, a griffin this close to the village? Strange. My thoughts exactly. In the forest of the mountains, sure, but here? Near the main road. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Drives monsters crazy sometimes. Men, too. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard. And we should leave as soon as we learn it. Kings do the fighting. That's it, Roach. The Temerian lilies, they've a right to hang there. This ain't Temeria no more, old man. It's Nilfgaard now. My arse it is. I'll not drink with Weaver Lost Freaks. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just passed through. Now a griffin's prowling about. Mm-hmm. Already had the pleasure. Ran into your kinsman, Bram. Bram? How is he? Alive. Sends his regards. Master witches. Food and drink on the house. What can I get you? Looking for a woman. Raven-haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white, riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Show me what you got behind the counter. mind to kill the griffin. Beasts are scourge on our land. Only killed livestock at first, but it's got a taste for human flesh of late. We're afraid to set foot outdoors. If someone will pay us, won't say no. Help you bandage that up? Please. I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask about Yennefer. Mm-hmm. 
Just remember, we'd rather not draw any attention. Yeah. Black one's been out measuring the fields. Let him measure. I'm looking for someone. And we seek some peace and quiet. Out of my face, freak. For your breath sours my beer. Dressed in black and white. Seen her? Talk. Folks say the lady rode through the village a few days back. Galloping so fast she knocked Radabor into a ditch. Which way did she go? Dunno. Lots of tracks leading off the main road. Could have gone anywhere. Oi, people! The freak's taken Micah's mind! Uh huh. And I'll take your tongue if you don't shut up. Four factions. Four? What a waste of time! The Earth shall revolve around the Sun before you comprehend these rules. Got a minute? Why not? Aldert Git, Assistant Professor in Contemporary History at Oxenfurt Academy. Geralt of Rivia. Witcher, with tenure. I'm looking for a woman. Long hair, dressed in black and white. Seen anyone like that? Of course not! Unlike the populace, I know the horsewoman of war is pure poppycock. Gotta go. So long. A moment, Witcher. You strike me as a man of the world. Are you familiar with Gwent? No, and I don't have time to learn. But the rules are quite simple. Come, let's play. Not. Splendid! Here's how it's done. It's not a game for everyone. It requires an analytical mind. If you ever find yourself in Oxenfurt and wish to play a true master, ask for Stepan. A simple innkeep by trade, but a true maestro when it comes to Gwent. I'll remember that. Thanks. Looking 
for a woman. Uh, like everyone. Not like everyone. And not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapsies. <laughs> It'll lift your spirits. Don't generally drink with strangers. Come. I know this to be a vile place. You might down a little glass merely to aid digestion. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Yennefer of Wengerberg. Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. And once I hear something, I never forget. Can't help it. How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballads, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. And runs into a very patient witcher. It's a Geralt of Rivia himself. The Butcher of Blaviken. You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask. Is this about love? None of your business. Yes. As a vagrant, I deserve no explanation. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An Ilf Guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark of night. Black and white. Gooseberries and... Yes, I know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. Thanks. We men of the road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble and you'll be nearby to help. Done drinking. Mm -hmm. Then fuck off. <laughs> Don't want your kind here. Better round up someone else to help. Three of you don't stand a chance against me. Well, I could fuck you up by myself. If I had a bag over my head and my hands tied behind... Actually, no, not even then. Chet, Lesh, back off. I'll teach this vagrant a lesson. Man on freak. Let's dance. Take it easy. Let's go! Freak. Move it! It's Durban now. D-E-R-V-A-N. Not Goidemar.
magic. A place of power. Military camp. No locals allowed without the express consent of the garrison commander. I look like a local to you? You look like trouble. Dead wrong. I make trouble go away. I'm a witcher. A witcher? Captain Peter Sugwin Levy is in the tower. Turn right, past the gate. Huh. You black ones aren't so scary after all can even be nice if you want to. Don't get accustomed, Nordling. To the tower. Go. 